Hello, everyone, and welcome in to an episode of Coral Island. This is a new game to me. I haven't really played much. I did create another game file just to test it out and see if it was a game that I was interested in playing since it's on my Xbox Game Pass on PC. And it it was kind of interesting. I was having fun with it, so I thought I would give it a try. So here we are at the character customization screen. I am going to try to make this very fast as character customization isn't really my strong suit or my favorite part of a game. I mean, I do enjoy it, but it's still, I don't know, a bit on the tedious side for me as I'm more of a decorator. I enjoy decorating more than anything. So let's just try to get through this process quickly, huh? You leave Pokio to start a new life on Coral Island. It's a very pretty game. I love the colors. Oh my goodness. Am I riding in a chicken boat? How cute. Oh, how beautiful. The colors are so vibrant, they really pop. Mr. Connor says, Hello, Birdie. Welcome back to Coral Island, your new home. It's been a long time, Birdie. Good to see you again. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor. <laughs> I trust you had a wonderful journey with Mr. Wateroo. Hmm, yes, it was safe and comfortable. Great, I expected nothing less from Mr. Wateroo. He's the best sailor you could ask for. You must be quite tired from the journey. Let's head over to your new place. Oh yes, please. I love this area. Jocko? Joko? Yoko. I am so sorry for any mispronunciation of the names. I am not really good with names. I'm so sorry. All right. The floors are done. Dinda? Dinda? Oh my, what a coincidence. We've just finished patching things up here. Is this the new farmer? That's right. Birdie, this is Dinda and Yoko. They're the local carpenters. Nice to meet you, Birdie, says Yoko. 
Gainda says, hello, Birdie. It's always exciting to welcome someone new to our little island. So this is it, huh? Indeed. Birdie, this will be your new house. It's a bit run down, but... Ahem. <clears throat> Excuse me, Mayor Connor? Did you just say we did a poor job here? <laughs> oh no, he's panicking. Connor says, uh, uh, no, I mean. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm just joking. Unfortunately, we could only patch up the roof so it doesn't leak and replace some of the rotten wood. If you want more renovations, you can visit our shop and house in Hillside, northeast of here. We won't charge you for it, but you'll need to gather the materials yourself. Once we restore the foundation, you can decorate the house the way you like. We've placed the complete instructions in your mailbox. Well then, it's about time we head home. See you both around. Take care, Birdie, and good luck. <laughs> Thank you, we're gonna need it. As you can see, people are very excited that you're here. Doubly so for Sam. You should pay him a visit once you're more settled in. He's the owner of the general store in town. And that is the field where I'm guessing you'll spend most of your time. Oh boy. Oh, how wonderful. We can do this. I'm so ready. Uh-oh. Oh, goodness. <laughs> She's panicking. It's a bit messy now, but I'm sure you'll take care of it in no time. Once you harvest your crops, you can put them or anything else you have to sell here in the shipping bin. I'll ship the content overnight to the appropriate stores in town and you'll receive the funds the following day. I'll be going now, so you can get some rest. Oh, since you just got here, you probably haven't bought anything you need for farming yet. Here's a little something from the town to get you started. Thank you. You received a watering can, an axe, a, a, a scythe, a, sky, a scythe, and some random seeds. I never knew how to say that. <laughs> If you need anything else, I'm at your disposal. Come to me with problems, questions, some mean sake. <laughs> Welcome home, Birdie. Aw, thank you, Mayor Connor. I appreciate it. Start new quest. Starting out, plant 10 seeds and then water them. Oh, okay. So I see we have our hoe tool, a digging and tilling tool, a pickaxe tool, a tool for breaking stones, and our watering can. It's useful for watering crops. Axe tool, a tool for chopping wood. A, I'm really gonna have to look up how to pronounce this. A scythe, a scythe tool, a tool to cut grass and weed. Also used for clearing trash. Turnip seeds. You can plant them in spring and they grow in four days. Yields regular quality. Awesome oh, daisy seeds. Plant in spring also grows in four days and yields regular quality. And then we have some candied tree seeds. They are consumable. A craftable snack to satisfy thrifty foragers for 60 stamina and 20 health. Hmm. I wonder what we'll use the health for. I did dabble a little bit in this game so I do know you use your stamina when you are doing anything like you know forging or farming related but what does the health 
do? Why do I need stuff for my health? Oh, sorry, I'm new to PC gaming. I might be switching over to the controller if this gets a little too slow. <laughs> Birdie, to repair your house, we'll need you to gather some materials. Please collect 50 wood and 20 stone. Once you have everything, head to the carpenter and place an order at the counter. Your house will be repaired on the same day. Your local carpenters. Okay. Um, farming. To grow crops, start by clearing debris from your farmland. Press the left mouse button while equipping a scythe, pickaxe, or axe to clear debris. Then equip the hoe and press the left mouse button to till the soil. Next, equip a seed bag and press the left mouse button to place seeds on tilled soil. Finish by equipping your watering can and pressing the, le the left mouse button to water the seeds. Crops need to be watered daily until they are ready for harvest. Okay. All right, um, let's see. This is for chopping wood. Oh, that's neat. Okay, we should probably only get what we need. And not much more. Just because I, I don't think I have much storage space here. Um, hmm. And by the way, if you know how to play this game, um, I would really appreciate that we keep spoilers out of the uh, comments. Just for myself and anyone else like me who hasn't played it, because I don't know anything about it, if it has a story or not. Oh, hang on. Do I need a... Oh, no. Maybe I can't get to it like that. Am I using the wrong tool? No. Um, there we go. But I do not mind any useful tips that you have. I just don't want any story spoilers. If there are any, this kind of seems like it's got a little story to it, though. Hmm. I made it to about this point. You know what? I think I'm going to just swap over to the controller. I know practice makes perfect, but that is something I think I'd rather do off camera so I don't waste anyone's time. Oh, wrong tool. Okay, so we needed 50 wood and 20 stone. We're halfway with the stone. We could use some more wood. Yes, but I do not mind tips at all. If you have any tips for me, please put them in the comment. The more the merrier. And if you play it, what are your thoughts on it? I'm curious as to what others think. I have not watched anybody play this before. I started to a long time ago, but then I was like, well, maybe that's a game that I can play for myself, so I don't really want to know anything. If it's a game I have intentions of playing, I won't watch somebody else play it because I I like to figure things out for myself, you know, like story-wise. But if I'm struggling with something in here and it's very clear that I'm just not getting it, please feel free to lend a helping hand. And I hope everyone is having a fantastic day today. I haven't really been putting much out on the channel the last couple of days. I've been super busy. My youngest had a sleepover and they can be quite rambunctious. They're like a dynamic duo <laughs> when the two of them are together. So um, I've had my hands full there. I didn't want to leave my fiance to be the only person. Whoa, uh oh, <laughs> to be the only person watching the kiddos. So I had to take a couple of days off. And then yesterday, also, the weather was really bad at my house. So we were trying to stay safe. We were under a tornado watch and had some nasty, oh, I already got it. Some nasty thunderstorms is all. Oh, wrong button. 
I'm going to go ahead and plant these guys because we can. Hmm. Suppose I could bring it this way. Um, sorry, tree. Nice. We're doing quite well. I just need two more stone and 30 more wood. This is pretty fun and so relaxing and peaceful. I wonder if there's any music that plays. I feel like that's about the only thing I'm missing is some music, some cozy music. Oh, that works too. I didn't know if I could do that. All right. This is so cool. <laughs> yeah, I didn't make it far at all into the game on my other save file. I was like, this will be really fun to share my experience with other people. So let's stop playing it. So that way, when new things happen, my reactions will be genuine. I mean, they always are. Even if I've seen something like a gazillion times, I can still <laughs> react almost the same as I did the first time. It's like watching a movie where you know something is going to happen. Um, and you can't help but start biting your nails because you're expecting it. But you know the outcome, but even still. Quest updated. Harvest your first crop. Visit Sam's general store. Okay. We should go and do that. I think my stamina is running low. Yay. Awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and fill up our watering can while we're here. Um, let's see. Let's go this way. I think I got to the point where you go and you meet people. But I didn't meet everyone. I only met like three people and was like, I'm sold. I'll play it. I'll at least give it a try on the channel. And if it doesn't do well on the channel, then it's still something I can play by myself. What's this? A calendar? An errand? Urgent request. The deadline is in two days. Ben is looking for one peony. Oh, okay. We can try that. Hi, friend. Who are you? Oh, this is Ben. Um, he's doing a little yoga. Oh, a new face. Feeling really good vibes from you, mate. Thanks, mate. Met Ben. <laughs> Look at the birds on the power lines. Oh, what wonderful details. Be careful up there, little birds. Those things can give you an electrical shock. This is the general store. Sam's local produce. How charming. Hey, Birdie, I knew you would eventually make your way here. I wanted to personally introduce you to the owner of this store. This is Sam. He's been running this establishment for a while now. Hello, Birdie. It's a pleasure to meet you. Welcome to the general store. You'll find most of your farming needs here. M most of the seeds I sell are seasonal, though. It would do you good to keep this in mind. If you need help, just holler. I'll be by the cash register. Well, isn't this nice, Sam? You might finally put a dent in that seed stock of yours. <laughs> anyway, before you get going, Birdie, your moving in was quite unexpected. I'm sure a lot of people are anxious. Well, more like curious to see who the new farmer is. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to folks in town? Okay. Awesome. Meet the townies. We've got to meet 25 more. The new farmer. Um, shop. 
Oh, look, here's some peony seeds. So we'll need to grow these so we can... Oh, they take four days, though. Huh, seems like most things take that long. Well, that's okay. I guess we'll have them on hand in case someone else needs them. All right. Okay, so harvest your first crop. That's gonna take us a few in-game days to do. Oh, hi there. Betty, how lovely to see a new face around here. You can call me Betty, dear. <laughs> Met Betty. Hi, Betty. Nice to meet you. Starlet Town Farm and Diving. Hmm. Oh, the clock is... Is that military time? 1750? I wonder how fast the time goes and if there's a way I could slow it down a bit. Let's look at settings. This looks like gameplay. Movement type, jog or sprint. Oh, game time speed. Let's, yeah, let's put this at 50%. Typewriter effect enabled. I like that. Oh, there we go. Low stamina animation. Okay. Combat mode. There's fighting. Oh, well. I would honestly prefer to do a hit to aggro just because it'll be easier on my hands if I don't have to go into combat. But now I know why I have health. Allow usage tracking. What does that mean? What's defaulted to no. Save changes, please. Um, oh. Hang on. <laughs> I accidentally changed that. Um, I don't really know what any of this stuff is. I try not to touch it because I don't know what a lot of that means. Um, there's our volume. I don't really hear much music, though. Oh, and is this like you can change how you want your keys to work. You can do it for the controller as well. That's nice. In your different languages. Accessibility. Oh, wow. A dyslexic font. That's really cool. I don't see that really in any games. This is the first time I've seen this. I really wish more games would do stuff like that. I don't think I have dyslexia, but sometimes I do jumble my um, my letters and stuff up. But I wouldn't need to enable this because it's it's very rare that I do it. But I, I do have a friend who is dyslexic and they would definitely appreciate this. So I, 10 out of 10, way to go. In a colorblind mode. Yes, thank you. I really like this. Okay. And that's all the settings. <laughs> yes, I didn't mean to, to change whatever I changed. Okay, see, now that makes more sense to me. It's 6 p.m. I'm not good doing the 24-hour format. Is this for that? No. <laughs> this is. Okay. We might have to call it a day here in a minute. We're getting tired. I wonder what time I have to go to bed by. I've, I've not played these kinds of games much, so I don't really know much about them. I tried to play Stardew Valley, but because it is a game that is kind of pixelated or is pixelated, it messes with my eyes really bad. It's one of the reasons why I can't play Minecraft. Um. It's too much for my eyes and it makes me feel sick to my stomach and I get really bad headaches. So it's just not a really good experience. 
So I just avoid those games when possible. Oh yeah, we're running out of energy. Oh, some coal. Okay, we have enough there. Um, I don't really want to overdo it. And I don't know how late I can stay out. Um, is this... Can I eat this? Oh, yes, right. Because it gives you plus 60. Is that enough to keep going? Yeah, it seems like it. We're getting closer. I'm trying to only take what I need. So I don't know how much inventory space that I have and a lot of these games rely heavily on inventory. Can I hold this? Oh, you can. Oh, what a lifesaver to my thumbs. Thank you. You can just hold this. <gasps> nice! We have enough. We can visit the carpenter now, but something tells me we might have to do that tomorrow because it's 7.30. Um, does it tell me how late people are open for? How do I access stuff? Nope, that's the wrong thing. Okay, here's a map. I'm here. So this is where we live. Um... Oh, there's a lot going on here. Oh, this moves fast. Oh, a recycling center. That's cool. Um, Millie and Yuri's house. Frank and Erica's house. Off. Oh, the Fish and Sips Tavern. <laughs> what a name. 12 p.m. to 11.50 p.m. And then Sam's store is only open until 5 p.m. Is that 9 to 5? Nice. It looks like we have a clinic, too. Um, that's also open until 5. The salon is closed today. Charles's house. I'm looking for... Um, oh, a vineyard. I'm trying to find... There's a blacksmith. Oh, the carpet. Oh, they're closed. This is where I need to go. So this is here. And I am oh, right here. So I can just go straight up this road tomorrow. I probably won't remember. I'm going to have to look back to the map. <laughs> but maybe I should go in and rest now. Oh, actually. We can. Plant these peonies that we got. I've. Oh, I only have the one. <laughs> I don't know why I thought I just bought a whole bunch of them. Oh, low stamina. You can consume food or drinks to recover stamina. Equip a food or drink and then press X to consume it. You can also go to bed to replenish your stamina. Um, let's put that there. And hurt it. There we go. Okay, so we have all of the stone and the wood that we need. So... Maybe we should go to bed. Um, shipping bin. Should I sell some of this? Is this how much I can hold all of this? Or only what's... Because these are different. <clears throat> I wonder if it stops here. And... I guess I can sell that. I don't really know what to do with trash. Um, yeah, that's good. <laughs> we have some work to do. We are definitely in a fixer-upper. Yes, go to bed. Day ended, year one, and spring one. Okay, we made 19 coin from other. Okay, I see. 
farming, foraging, ranching, mining, diving, fishing, catching, and other. Next day, please. Okay, it is 6 a.m. Let's start the day by watering our crops. Oh. <laughs> Whoopsies. Here's the music. We go wonderful and we'll just go ahead and fill this back up all right let's go meet some people oh maybe we can find one of those flowers out you think they grow in the wild the peonies can I pick these oh hi Suki Oh, hey, it's nice to see you again. Oh, I met her. No, met Suki. Have I? I mean, oh, those are violets and you can pick them. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I'm sorry. It, it'll be nice to have more farmers here. Being able to get local produce will be a game changer. Aw, I don't think I can do anything with this. I tried to pick it. Can I use this? No. <laughs> Maybe there's something else we'll figure out later. I feel like that can do something though. Hi, Alice. Is that, is that you, Birdie? It sure is. Wow, I almost didn't recognize you in that getup. Oh, so you're the one moving into the lot, huh? That would explain the outfit. Well, thank you. I do try my best. This is so pretty. Hi there. Oliver. My name? Hmm. My name's Oliver. Why? Oh, no reason. I just want to go around and meet the townsfolk. Hmm. Town Center. Cherry Blossom Festival. Spring Tent. Okay. Whoa. This place is huge. Wow. Yoga. Join now. Oh, how very zen. It's so peaceful in here. But does anyone work in here? Maybe it's not open. I might be here too soon too early it's very pretty oh my goodness inspect this is coral island and that's the pier wow starlet town rank hmm. i feel like i'm being nosy inspect it's a very old guest book it might be haunted better not to touch it Okay. Whoopsies. What's over here? Um, what? Hang on. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's not very nice. I hope y'all are playing. Play nicely now. Oh, he did not like being bopped on the nose. Boop. <laughs> he did not like it. Oh, you're doing your thing. We'll give you some privacy. You're trying to use the potty. Oh, this is so pretty. And I can talk to you? Oh, hang on. Oh. Oh, there you are. Cody. Cody looks happy today. Aw. Hey, you two. Omar is busy and can't talk right now. <laughs> 
Who are you? Fast is busy and can't talk right now. Hi. Copper. Copper looks happy today. Aww. What can I do for you? Whoa. A pet house blueprint. An outdoor shelter for a pet. You can have a pet? Oh my goodness. Out of stock. Whoa. Huh. Oh, wait, adopt a pet? <gasps> what? Oh, how beautiful. Oh my goodness. I thought I just saw Omar twice. Let's see, we have Bast, Frankie, Gary Kun, Kimba, Omar, Mr. Fluff, Malcolm, Kit Kat, Trinket, Copper. Hip, hip pastrum? Lindy. Getty. Fizz. Cody. Bode. Spiker do. Spike bonkers. Inari. And Luna. Oh my goodness. Luna, what a pretty name. Oh, this is amazing. I I love. Oh hi. Millie. Yes, Birdie. I've been meaning to meet you. My name is Millie. It's so exciting to have people moving in. <laughs> Met Millie. Library. You don't have any books to donate. Oh. Oh. Okay. Kind of looks like you need quite a bit. Oh, she runs the library. Are you visiting me? Not quite yet doesn't seem like I have anything for you. All right. Oh, hi. I'm sorry to interrupt, Mr. Randy. My name is Randy. I'm an elementary school teacher. What did you say your name was? Zoe. You're the new farmer who owns that lot. I used to play there with my friends. Aw, you can still play there. Valentina. Hello, Miss Birdie. Nice to meet you, too. I'm Valentina. They are just so precious. Oh my goodness. Very studious. Archie. Are you really the new person? Dad said you were a farmer. Is that right? What kind of farming tools do you have? Okay, I believe you. Why don't you look like a farmer, though? I'll take that as a compliment, friend, no matter how you put it. The museum is closed today. Okay. Hopefully they're opened. I think I can go this way. I am here. Yes, there's Dinda. There we go. Yes, I'm heading in the right direction. Oh, <laughs> it's right here. All right. Here we go. Quest updated. Repair your house. Carpenter. Oh. Ooh. I don't think I can do any of this just yet. Hmm. Um. Oh, house upgrade. Can I do any of these? I think so. Oh. Oh, wow, so many choices. Oh, what am I gonna choose? Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Awesome, thank you. I'll work on it right away. Yoko, honey, a slight change of plans. Birdie's here with the building materials. Let's head over to the farm and repair Birdie's cabin. Yes, let's please. Wow, 
That's awesome, Birdie. Let's do it. Dinda and Yoko are repairing your house. How are the house upgrades? More comfortable, right? Now, move it and help me get your stuff inside, kiddo. Okay. <laughs> Look at these guys. Look at this team. We're gonna do great. Aww. Little cozy chit chat. <laughs> Very nice. Whew, that old thing was really heavy. We're finished. What do you think, Birdie? Hmm. Looks brand new. Thank you. No more holes. Thanks. How long is the warranty? It looks brand new. Thank you. <laughs> is it? I'd say we can do better. Oh, there was a question mark by that one. Look, no more moldy wood. We replaced all of it. We also built a new foundation for the house. That means it's strong enough for more furniture now. You can start decorating to make things comfier. Speaking of decoration, we have a furniture store in town, but since there are fewer tourists, we don't stock many options anymore. No one's buying, you know. Check it out though. You might see something you like. If you want, we can go there right... All right, that's enough. You'll scare the kid. Oh, sorry, Birdie. I got too excited there. We love that store. Even got some of my cousins helping out there. That's a family business for us. Feel free to visit when you have the time, Birdie. It's in the middle of the town. Shouldn't be hard to find. Will do. All right. That's all for... Honey, aren't you forgetting something? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah. The TV. We threw in a TV for you, Birdie. Free of charge. Thank you. It's old and bulky, but it still works perfectly. It gets a good amount of channels too, like this weather. <laughs> well, sometimes you gotta smack it a good, smack it good at a 60 degree angle like this. The channels are very useful, like the weather report on the weather channel. So you can skip watering the crops on rainy days to go fishing or something. I don't know what you like to do, but you get the idea. There are a variety of shows too. Love them. Some shows have useful tips if you play, pay close attention. I guess that's all for now. See you around, Birdie. See you, Birdie. Don't forget about the furniture store, all right? <laughs> will do. I will definitely stop by. I love furniture stores. Your house just got bigger. Yay. Oh, goodness. All right, let's just test out this TV. How to be a farmer. Weather forecast. Welcome to WBC, your main weather-related news source. The forecast covers Coral Island and the surrounding area. Weather forecast for tomorrow. Wet and rainy. Okay, perfect. So that means we are not going to have to water our crops tomorrow. How to be a farmer. How to be a farmer with Jeff Smith. My name is Jeff Smith, and I know a thing or two about farming. I was raised in a farm, so I got some tips for you, Sprouts. Let me tell you about them. I'm going to tell you the first thing my pop told me when I planted my first corn in 19 LXI. <laughs> Water your crop every day. That's it. You get that down? Chances are you'll be okay, Sprouts. But you do need to water when it's raining. You don't need to water when it's raining, you hear? 
Oh, that's so awesome. Coral shopping. Welcome to Coral Shopping. Oven. With an oven, you can bake cookies, pumpkin pies, and lots more. If savory treats are more to your taste, try a risotto. Available now at Socket and Pan for 3600C. <laughs> Is there anything else? No? Just turn off. All right. That is awesome. Okay. So we have watered our plants. Let's go explore. Let's see him. Go to journal. Home sweet home. Claim reward. Meet townies. Deliver one peony to Ben. I wonder if we can find this anywhere since our deadline is tomorrow. Trying to remember what they looked like on the bag. I think I'm blocked in that way. What's up here? Oh, hi. Hi. Who are you? Kenny. You're Birdie. I heard about you. I heard you're looking for some fresh air away from the city. I sure am. This is just my cup of tea. Oh, look at you. Mud bathing in the sun. <laughs> to each his own. I loved playing in the mud when I was a kid. Uh-oh. Oh, can you catch bugs? Hi. Hi, I'm I'm sorry. I know I'm chasing after you and that's kind of scary. Uh-oh, wrong thing. Oh, I can't help out. I guess you can only water your own stuff. They looked a bit dry. Oh, hi, who are you? Zara, a new farmer in town? You moved here after the oil spill, huh? I'm Zara. See you around. Very ominous. I like her, though. Any, um, peonies back here? Perchance? Oh, pretty. Aw. None that I see. Hmm. I think we just need the one, right? Oh, what's that? It's smoking. You don't understand what it says. Oh, well, it might be making us sick if we stand too close to it. Are these train tracks? What are what's over here? What are these? Harvest. I don't think those are the ones. I think I'm looking for um, pink ones. Ooh, danger. You hear the clanking of swords from inside. You wonder if there is some fighting going on. Oh, wow. Okay, so best not go in there just yet. Oh, what's this? Oh, no, that's, that's canola. That's what that is. So now we know. Oh, sorry, butterfly. It's probably like of all the places you could have run through. You just had to run through this little field here. I was minding my own business. And then this just wraps around right back through here. Okay. Hmm. I liked the sound of the fire crackling. It sounded very nice. It reminds me of a, a slightly chilly autumn evening. And then we were here. It's going to take me a little bit of time to get to know the town. Oh, hi. <laughs> I think I've met you guys. Yeah. Yep. 
I won't disturb you. You look like you're hard at work. It's something I should be doing. I am looking for a flower. Oh, they're right here next to my farm, too. What does this mean? Press the R button? <gasps> Whoa. This is my farm? This whole area? Ooh, we have got our work cut out for us. Yes. Any advice or tips that you guys have for me, feel free to share them in the comments below. Which one is this again? The violets. Okay. We'll go ahead and grab all of these. I wonder if I'll find those flowers, the peonies that we're looking for. The coral inn. I'm not really going inside places right now because I'm trying to find this peony. I don't know if there are any that are growing in the wild. But I would really love to finish that since I said that I was going to do it. But it might be a bit on the challenging side for me to do it so early on in the game. But if I don't get to, at least I have them growing for now. Oh, what a wonderful beach. Yeah, I keep seeing these things. Oh, hi. Oh, you're eating tacos. That's what I had for dinner tonight. Oh my goodness. Hey. What's all of this? Is this trash? We're gonna have to clean this place up. Oh yes. Oh, you know what? Do I have room? How do I access my inventory? I have a little bit of room. Let's go clean some of that up. I think we can sell this stuff. Can I use this? Oh. <laughs> yes, that's what this is. It's all trash. That's not good. There we go. Let's make the ocean water more habitable. That's much better. I wonder if this will respawn back here. If this is something that'll have to be cleaned up a lot. Oh, hi. Here. Don't mind me. Sorry. Just wanna get this trash. Sunny, the new farmer. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Hi, welcome. Theo, oh yeah, yeah, I heard about you. You're the new farmer from San Francisco, right? Oh, that's right, Pokio. I'm Theo, <laughs> San Francisco. <laughs> That's funny. There we go. We've made this an, a much nicer place. Cleaned it up a bit. Hmm. I still haven't found any peonies. I don't think they're going to grow on the beach, though. Oh, wow. What's over here? Hmm. This town is full of secrets, it looks like. Huh. Open chest. <gasps> That's a chest? Ooh. There are chests here that you can find? What? That's really cool. Hmm. No peonies. 
Well, I'm glad the day seems to be going by a little bit slower, so I feel like I have a little more time to search. Oh, how pretty. I just noticed these waterfalls. Little Mermaid. And I'm not quite sure what you are. Nope, nothing back here. Peonies! I've forgotten what you looked like. <laughs> Coral shopping. Socket and pan. Oh. I need a bigger house to put cooking utensils. Oh, really? Oh, well, can I talk to you? Luke. Yes, may I help you? My name's Luke. Pleasure is mine. Nice to meet you, Luke. Can I talk to you? No. Nope. She's busy. Well, something tells me I don't belong back there. Oh, here's the furniture store. For lease? There's a for lease sign behind it. Um, I can't talk to you. What can I do for you? Outdoor decor? <gasps> oh my goodness gracious. What? A hedge fence? A stone hedge fence? Stone pebble floor tile? A hedge gate? Wooden flower arch gate? A camp grill? A flower rock arch? A camp bonfire? White flowering bush? Oh, oh my! Lamppost? Square stone flower pot, a log chair, what? More bushes, oh my goodness. This is a bit overwhelming. A rickety fence and gate, <gasps> a rickety arch. Oh, me oh my, I love all of this. Oh, I am so excited. This is a lot of money though. I guess we'll make it as we go. We just have to be patient. By indoor decor, my goodness. What? Wow. So very pretty. Is this all just demonstrated right here for you to see? How wonderful. So beautiful. I love the design. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at the pile of clothes and the laundry hamper. The cabin indoor plant. Oh, and the hanging plants. Oh, I love plants. I wish I could have more around my house, but they're so expensive. Like my actual house. Um... Yeah, I can't afford to shop here right now, but I do look forward to doing business with you in the future. You have wonderful items. Wow. Oh, and what is this? This is closed. Oh, a clothing store. You can buy clothes? I thought this was just my outfit. There's a lab here. What do you use the lab for? Oh, hello. Soria. Oh, you're Birdie. I've heard about you from my Uncle Yoko, the carpenter. Tall, mustache, no. Nope. <laughs> well, hello, Soria. Kind of feel like I'm not meant to be in there just yet. Oh. Hmm. Straight ahead is to the woodlands this way? Oh, maybe not. Oh, what's this? Is it supposed to look like that? It looks incomplete. Oh. Sorry, buggy. Oh, 
and then we were here earlier. My goodness, I'm, oh, no entry. What is this? What are you guys building? Derek, oh, hey, what's up? <laughs> oh, well, I can't look and see. Oh, I've, I've talked to you. Hmm, how many more people do we need to talk to? Oh, we're close. Just um, seven more to go. And here's the blacksmith. Whoa. Hi, Raphael. Shop. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm quite ready for you yet, sir. Oh, hi there. <laughs> Hi. I love how the music changes when you go into different um, homes and buildings and stuff. Oh, how pretty. A nice little playground for all the kiddos. Oh, I remember this. Oh, <laughs> these were so much fun. Uh-oh. Except for when you would get injured. Pablo, you must be Birdie, right? Damn, I wasn't expecting you to look like this. You're surprisingly cute. No, oh, stop it. You're making me blush. <laughs> well, he's a flirt. You don't understand what it says. Okay. That's okay. We'll get there. Hmm. Oh, hi. Emma. So the rumors were true after all. Welcome to town. We got a new scientist in town last month, too. Can't remember his name, though. It's Surya. Anyway, I hope you like it here. Thanks. Can I order any? Oh, you can't buy anything from here. Okay. Well, that's okay. What's this place? Oh, this is a school. Okay. Um. Oh, school's not in anymore. Everyone's gone for the day. Oh, this is really pretty. What's over this way? Hello. I hope you don't mind me entering. Oh, this is like someone's house. <laughs> Let's let's get out of there. We don't belong in there. What's over here? Inspect. The paint is still wet. Don't touch it. Okay. Aw. There's so many different ways you can go. Oh, I'm blocked off. And then this takes you back up and around through here. Hmm. No peony. Oh, hi. Deepa. Huh, Birdie? I'm Dippa. N nice to meet you, Dippa. I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. <laughs> oh, I must have met you already. I just need to meet three more people. Oh, this is a really pretty area. Oh, hi. Have I met you? Anne. Good day, stranger. Oh, you just moved to the farm? Welcome to the community. My name is Anne. Nice to meet you, Anne. Hey, Anne, do you happen to know where a peony is by chance? I could really use one. The day is almost done. Alun, Alun Square. Oh. Can I come over here? This looks very pretty. Oh. Whoa. <gasps> Whoa. What? <gasps> oh, very pretty. Oh 
Oh my goodness. What's this? You wonder what these swirling flowers are. There's so much to uncover here. I don't think I was meant to find this just yet. But I guess that's what exploring for peonies will do. <laughs> oh, area closed off for festival use only. Okay. Well, I should probably be heading home. It looks like I won't be able to help with the peony. I can't find any. Hmm. A temple is up that way. It's probably best that I don't head that way. Not quite sure how to get home. Oh wait, I think I can keep going this way. This way? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, hang on. I'm by the carpenter's house. I know that I can get to my farm. Nope. Somewhere down this way. I'll find it. I think. <laughs> have I talked to you? Oh, I have. I'm sorry. Didn't mean to block you or enter into your personal space. Maybe we should pull the map up. Okay, we can keep going down this way. And then it'll bring us home. Okay. We're okay. Yes, and we're home. We'll go ahead and put this trash in here. Um, this one has a star. Does that mean it's special? Scrap. Do I want scrap? I'm not sure if I want scrap or not. We'll hold on to that canola as well. Um, there we go. All of our stuff is watered for today, and we don't have to worry about it tomorrow because it's supposed to rain. All right, let's go to sleep. I think this is where I'm going to end it for today because I've been doing this for um, an hour and 10 minutes. So we'll pick it up another day where we will finish meeting the townies and hopefully um, finishing out the harvester first crop. But I appreciate you guys tuning in. Feel free to leave me any tip, any tips in the comments if you have any. Um, I look forward to reading the comments and seeing what you think about it. If you would like to see more of this on the channel, just please let me know because like I said, unless this video does decently, I probably won't continue to share them. But thanks for tuning in. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and a wonderful week and the weekend is getting near. So bye now. <laughs>